As I was leaving the house, the zip went on my only winter jacket. I'm going to have to try and fix it before I go anywhere. We went for a walk the other day um, up to a reservoir and my wheels fell like they were dragging. Which was always a bit strange because I'd uh, recently pumped them up, pumped them up in the morning. And then it felt like it was the front left wheel kept dragging on the front and kept making me veer to the left. So I stopped and I got my little multi-tool out and took the, took the axle apart, the caster apart and then got rid of the gunk and everything out of it and I thought that would fix it and it didn't seem to, it was like, it just felt a bit odd still, like it just felt like something was dragging, something caught in the wheel and then I got back and then I sat in my chair the next day and I felt the wobble I was like, oh dear, it feels like there's something wrong, there might be something bent in the in the frame. But it turns out I've got a puncture in my tire. So I'm gonna head to Halfords, which I believe will still be open even though it's in lockdown. I'm gonna get them to sort my wheel out and swap the tire in. Right, so I'm here at Halfords, and after about, I don't know, probably about 15 minutes of just messing with this, I managed to fix the zip. So basically what happened is that it'd come open, and like, I'll put it together now. God, I've ruined it. But it just come open, and then it, it was just up to the top. The zip was stuck, and then the rest was open. Um, and I don't really have the funds to start buying new coats it's my only really proper winter warm coat, so. Um, anyway, I'm going to head in here and uh, get, hopefully I can get my, my tyre sorted. Okay. Oh, okay. Cool. Just on my episode. So I can't cut it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, that's a shame. So basically, I've got 24-inch wheels. And then the inner tube is 24 by one, which is very small and very narrow, uh, where they do lots of 24s, and then 24, uh, but it's 24 by 1.7, which is way too big. And the only ones they had in that are the regular valves, but I use Presta valves, which are basically sport valves, and it's a higher pressure, um, which are better for wheeling, obviously. So I'm not able to get it done today, but I'm going to, uh, there's a few places that they suggested. Um, it's really interesting though, because I feel like it's hard to hide the camera. So it's hard to pretend 
that I'm not filming things. And they were really, really helpful, like above and beyond telling me places I could go and things of like that because they genuinely felt really bad. And maybe they know that I was filming things and that's why they put the extra F out. So it's interesting. If you can get the size you want though, they're brilliant. They they always, they, they deliver. So it's just a shame that I didn't have the size. So next time it's a case of me buying the inner tube and then taking it to Halfords because not enough people use the size that I need. Anyway, I'm gonna get myself a coffee and then I'm meant to meet and Becky for a walk, but it is wet. So the burst tire saga continues. Hello. Alright. All right.